a la verdad. G'day, fucking g'day. I'm live, sort of. Alright, here. None of that. How is everyone? It doesn't seem to have started yet. Shame. Took a fucking while, didn't it? There we go, good enough. It ain't starting soon anymore, it started. You took too long. Silly thing. But yeah. What do I need to do now? That's the real question. Oh, what do I want to do? I don't know. Um. Let me figure out where I want the alerts. Let's get Sai up, I think. That'll be good. Because if I get that up, I'll touch up some more of the overlay stuff. <clears throat> and then I can move around for different overlays. That would be good. But I'm going to think what I want in some of the other spots. It's a bit difficult to show this just yet. I mean, I could switch to a different overlay just to temporarily show it. I can't be bothered. <laughs> I might do. I mean, I can just show it in the side. Because that'll at least give a good idea. But, yeah, yesterday we did, I did some good old, some really good fucking work on... Um, upgrading the overlay. Um, which is good. Uh, still need a tiny bit more work to do on it. Um, and seeing as this morning, the stream's gonna have to be broken up into two parts. I figured that's probably the best place to start, I guess. Um, yeah, just simply due to the fact that, I mean, it just makes sense. Oh, no, 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 no. I've got to figure out, maybe I'll just open recent, might be better. Is this what I'm looking for? But yeah, this morning's only going to be a few hours to begin with. Because i got to then deliver and do a few things, and then we're back a bit later. So keep an eye out on the Discord when I will return. But, let's have a gears of what we were doing yesterday. Because, I think that's the main thing. Um, because we did a lot of work yesterday, and it sort of worked. Like, there's still a bit that I want to go, like, work towards and stuff for the overlay. So I might do some overlay work this morning, um, and then probably switch across this afternoon to whatever the fuck people want to do. Wait. Yes, I got my mic on. <laughs> for a second there, I thought, shit, I forgot to turn my mic back on. 
filter's still fucking on. I always leave the dust filter on. I'm an absolute moron. I don't know why I do that, but I do that. I do be doing that. But, um, let's go over to the art, which is the old overlay, obviously, because I haven't made the art overlay yet. What I want to do is, let's switch it to, there we go. Let's transfer. Oh. Cool. So, obviously it's not highlighting some of the other stuff that I did work on yesterday, like the borders on the chat box, because uh, the borders there, if I turn them on, ooh, like you can sort of see that um, those borders, those ones, what? Hold on, before I continue, this chat box, what in the fuck's happened to it? Fair, I guess, but the borders just removed itself from existence. Uh, cause like this morning, the reason stream was a bit delayed was there was an update to Windows and it just like reset all the default devices. So I had to go through everything like, okay, browser audio, everything else is fucking annoying. Thanks, man. Yeah, no. So <laughs> this morning I was a bit delayed cause just the up Windows update reset everything. And now the border for this old one just <laughs> seems to have died. But how are you going today? But yeah, no, I tested out the border, um, tested out the overlay yesterday with some games, which was good. It works, it's still working, work in progress, I think. Like, up there is where the, the link tree thing's gonna go. Um, chat border's okay, but when it transferred across to the other one, it was a bit weird. Um, let's have a look at that. Is this the right one? Here it is, yeah. So when I did this, um... Let's go canvas, canvas background, transparency, color. Uh, for some reason, it got rid of some of those. Not too bad. Got to put some laundry away. Hell yeah. <laughs> got to love a housework. Yeah. But yeah, no. Nah, that's the same here, sort of like, obviously later I got to do some housework. It's both annoying, but makes sense. Um, but yeah, because that's why my stream will be two parts today. But, if I went back to here, why did this... So the sh Oh, I think I know why. Because over here, I've made it those colors, but the reason it has those effects is because of the background below it. And so, I think some of the issues I was having when I was transferring it is because those effects change the color and pattern based off the stone behind it. That makes things a little difficult. Um, I think the other thing that I wanted to look at was obviously that looks nice pattern wise, but then chat, you don't sort of want it smudging through there. So I either want chat to be hidden with some like triangles or cogs uh, so that it can come up straight from the bottom, or I want chat to be a little higher up. Um, is That's going to be one of the main things, I think. Um, one of the other things I figured out when I was looking at things yesterday was that the text um, itself, uh, the actual name for the text of the donos and stuff like that are there, um, they were clear, but the actual sort of text about what it is was a little, wasn't as legible as I would have hoped. Um, so I think that's th number two of what I want to look at. And then number three is really just like the corners here of like, they're nice pattern wise, but they do block out some of the screen, so I gotta figure out if that's worthwhile. Um, I'm gonna see. Can I if I switch to the this folder, it'll at least let me have a look at roughly. So let me just do this. You won't see a screen innately, but let me just I'll just show you. So yeah, this is what I was working on sort of. A reader I want this. The I don't know where I want the fucking voice thing anymore. Um, yeah, so slightly, things that will be slightly need to be adjusted, as you can probably tell. I'll do that. That should be okay-ish. There we go. Yeah, so there's some of the thing of like, you can see with the text there, it, the text on the chat is okay. I might want to put something to make it a little bit clearer. The text down these bottom bits here, not as much. There are two boxes there that I need to look at. 
I guess that's because there's one here and one there. Um, so there's a few things. So this is just the example here that is showing there's a few things I do want to work on. Um, it could also be that I might have the old overlay on underneath it. Yeah, I do. <laughs> That'd do it. So I want to make that chat box spot um, a more official spot. And i got to figure out how I want to do that. If you have any ideas, feel free to let me know. Um, but I do need to make the text a little more legible. But that's just going to be a stream elements thing. Maybe make my own icons, but I can just adjust them for now. But I think it's just a little bit of fine tuning this morning. Where do I want the cat as well is another good question. The cat could go on top of the Discord, but it still blocks a few things visually. Unless I'm like there, then I might want to change the name size. There's a few questions I have, I guess. Um, but feel free to let me know if you have any thoughts and suggestions as well. I could just hide the name and just put the cat in the cog. That'd be kind of funny. But how well would that work? I could just put it somewhere if I change the size of it. Because I could put the cat in here because that's kind of cute. Because people don't really care about its level and its name. I could shrink the cat and put the cat there. That could work. There we go. Okay, so that's fixed out the cat thing. So that's giving that the cat there. Got the link tree thing. I think text wise is okay. I do want to do something that'll make it a bit more legible. Uh, especially with the actual text text. I think that's going to be the main thing. The Discord bit. Uh, I'm not too sure, but what's your thoughts, Rybal? Uh, sorry if I butchered how the pro uh, pronunciation is, but let me know if you've got any thoughts on, um, just from someone else visually, how things are, how you think things might need changing and going along and stuff. Um, aside from the actual background image itself, which I can paint and upgrade, because I think if I went back, yeah, because the is issue here is was a little unlegible, inleg oh, fucking words. <laughs> But let's just go to here, properties. How is it visually? Because that fits everything, or it should. Do, 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 do. Because I want to make sure that it's clearer or neater. Cat looks good there. If there's not too much action, there's not too much action, might be best to leave it out for now. There is action on the Discord, but the link there is the old Discord that's just like a. Until I finished making the better one, it's sort of like an extra, it's like a backup thing until I, so that way if there's like scam bot accounts, they'll just see it and not care about it immediately. Um, but yeah, people that all join that Discord, I can just fling them over to the new one until the new one that has a lot going on is actually properly set up. Um, hell yeah, vibe time. Hell yeah, Googly, how you going, man? Um, I'm just showing where this has been working so far, brainstorming of what I want to do and then going back to it. But yeah, the if you're in the the old Discord, I can fling in. You going okay? Hell yeah. Yeah, what I want to do is I want to, I think, the main thing, the, the text that goes along is fairly um, legible. The icons I might want to change a little bit. So maybe I'll do that first. That'll be a bit easier. Um, but I think it's just that main informative text, I think I would call it. So let's look, what's the easiest one to fix? Well, the side ones, probably. The side one to the left there is meant to be, uh, recent donor. How do I make that more legible, is the first question. Because if I can make that left bit more legible, that'll be worthwhile. Um, so I gotta think, what do I want that? Potato? Potato. Tomato, tomato. But yeah, so... Aside from potato, potato, tomato, tomato. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going to think, how do I want to make the Discord neater? The actual chat itself, hmm. Yeah, because it's the, the little text spots that, when transferring from stream elements to here, seem to be a little bit less legible, I guess, would be the best way to put it. I don't know why, they just are. Maybe it lowers, it's a lower of, well, I don't know, but it's also potentially because it's a preview on my end, and so I'm not fully aware of how it looks. So let me know if things are 
off and I haven't noticed them. But I think right now, let's I'll work on some text. But text I can work on in my spare time. I don't want to. That's not visually something people really care about. What I probably want to do then is if I'm thinking more visually for other people and just for the general concept, I think the main thing I'll want to work on is how to make the chat box where the text is pop a tiny bit more. Um, I think that'll be the first thing. And am I adding cogs or anything to where the chain is and the text box? So if we fling back over. Yeah, so if we fling back over of the raw concept there, what I know that I'll need to do is me a tired, same, tired gang. Why are you tired, Googly? Is it just because you're up late? Uh, are you a tired bean? Like, Googly, are you totally tired? My voice is dead. So I can't do any voices. Meh, meh, meh. Potter. Um, let me. Hmm. But yeah, I would love to hear anyone else's thoughts as well. But I think where that Discord box goes is probably the best spot. But like when Discord chats come up, maybe change and resizing or something. Uh, if other people have thoughts, let me know. But I think what I'll probably do then is, hmm, I guess I will, hmm, I will think, hmm, recent? What do I want to get recent? Uh, let's open up this one from ages ago. No, not late, just 7 p.m. almost. And I'm tired because of school. Yeah, that makes sense, man. School go okay today, man? What? Got this. Let's just grab this as the concept for now. Right. Canvas by selection for now. If I use this as a concept, as a raw concept, export is PNG. Uh, I'll call it Pat and put it in the, I guess, art main. That'll be the easiest way to find it. Go over to here. Open. Where the fuck did I put it? Uh, art main. Art main. Coming to centimeters near you. Well, there we go. And now, why compress everything when I can just do that? Control A, Control C. Let's go over here. Control V. Magical. Now, if I was to put this in this little spot here, um, because it's a cool little tattoo-y thing. It fits that sort of volcanic-y sort of rock marbly vibe. That's sort of what I've got behind the Discord sneakily anyway. I could have, I could put it back behind the Discord, or I could put it sort of blurred. Either way, what I'll need to do is I... Let's try it as an overlay first. Because, yeah, because an overlay will, generally does the job pretty well. How much darker does that make it? Uh, I guess I can just change it to like that, maybe. Screen? Screen makes it lighter. So, do I want it like a cave painting? Like that. A multiply? Oh, that, yeah, that's that's a bit too strong, eh? Because it just multiplies everything. Shade shine. Not entirely. Burn dodge. Bit better. Not what I'm looking for, though. I think I do like that. Uh, I do like the look it has as, as sort of a overlay, but that might make it too dark. Uh, what do you guys think? Um, would you prefer that chat box? If we went back, sorry, briefly. Oh, oh. yeah, so if we went back to here as like the example, um, would that chat box, would everyone think it's better as like that darker sort of overall chat box? Or would it be better as just sort of like a little design or put it somewhere else entirely? Um, sorry. Oh. Surprise, I'm still here. But yeah, I think the main thing is that I want to make sure, because I can, the main things I think is sort of having it as like a screen, my worry there is it will make things a little bit too, how do you put it? Um, Yeah, it loses some of the contrast, I think. And in doing so, that's not popping. 
as much as it looks nice as a picture when text scrolling up it, I think it probably will hinder it. So let's try, let's do it as an overlay. Make it a bit like that, maybe. So now I guess I gotta go back to chat box stone here, which means I do this and I've got the area of it. Not entirely what I wanted. That means I probably want the other one. Where is it? Hmm. Boom, boom, boom. Music. Now let me know if the volumes are okay because OBS decided to reset everything, so. I don't know if the volumes are right. Do, do, what the fuck am I looking for? Do, 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 real, real. I mean, I can just put some text there, but that comes up a lot clearer than actual stream text. Which is something I could look into. But I'm not very bright. Uh, those are the box stone. Oh, I should label things so much better than I am. Is this it? No, that's the overlay I'm fucking looking at. Ah! Doom, doom. Yeah, I don't care. I'm not, the runes aren't what I'm looking for, as much as they're nice. I'm looking for that. Let's just do this. I just want to look. Yeah, that's not it. This is the corners cut. That's the old one, if I wanted it. Is it? Oh, no. Maybe it's not. Maybe I'm stupid. <laughs> Which is not a rare thing, but it could just be that I'm stupid. No, yeah, that's the corner area that cuts off those corners. I'm looking for the actual stone. Which I think is this. <clears throat> I think it is. If I do this, uh, oh yeah, because if I do that, then the other thing sort of goes above it, and it's all like, Mrr. but don't you dare! I could do that. Um, I could do that, and then go back up to fucking Scooby Dooby Doobus, wherever that is. Here, yeah, and do it. Hmm. Thank you, Yoda. Your wisdom knows no bounds. Invert that then dare selection. Delete that. Control D is nuts. Um, so then if I went back to here. Oh, do 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 do. Is this it? Ah, that would be better. I can select that. And then I can go all the way. I can back up 500 odd layers. I hope I find it. There it is. Invert the selection. Let's do it. Bam. Control D. There. So that's okay. So we've got that little box that looks a little bit nicer. It's a little bit neater. It's working a bit better now. Um, I think it's the main thing. Uh, so we got that. That'll be a bit nicer when we're looking at the actual chat text-wise. Um, it'll be a bit darker, better contrast. Now do I want to do something similar to these boxes down here? Hmm. Because I know at the very least the text was a bit off. Um, but I know I also probably want to put some borders or something around those cogs. But it might also be better just to make my own. Hmm. Um, so we've got those. We got where the link tree thing will be up the top. That's a fairly easy fix what we've got going here. The difficult thing is how I want to reset up that Discord sort of box. So what we could do is a few things. Let me know if people have suggestions or ideas. I like ideas. But what I'm thinking is I need potentially to either cut out that left bottom left corner so the Discord box can go there so people can see who's talking, or I put it somewhere else. Um, I also need to put somewhere for that chain, which we can't see here, but we can see in the example if I went back to it. Because around these top corner areas, like the chain's going along here. Might put one there eventually down the bottom. Um, but that might be too distracting or too cluttered. And cat goes up here, link tree goes there. I think it's just these spots here that I could probably put cogs or something there. I'm not too sure. Um so if people have suggestions, <laughs> let me know. Because I'm a bit a bit lost in what I want to do for those corners. 
uh, obviously we can just adjust and make this image nicer and cleaner and stuff like that. Um, but in here, these boxes themselves, mm, I could put more overlays sort of a bit like that just to make it darker. But I'm thinking I could also, mm. so the issue we were having, let's look at the example. Sorry again. Ha. Boo. Uh, yeah, so if we look at the example uh, before I put in that thing in the chat box, we can see how the chat box will probably be a bit better. Um, what I probably still need to do, though, is I could change the color of the chain. That could work. Oh, actually, how would I do that? I would have to, if I wanted to change the color of the chain, but still have it as a GIF without changing the whole file, I would not put it on OBS. No, I wouldn't put it on Stream Elements. I'd put it on OBS and change the color. So it'd be more like bronzy. I might not be bothered to do that just like, and I think I like the contrast because if I have it as bronze, it'll just be another brown and it'll blur a bit too much. So I think bottom left, we can see that's sort of where I want the chat box for Discord to pop up. So if we work off that, and as an example, could cut a chunk out there. Um, could have it as a full box, could have it as a circle. Um, I may not even need a box around it. Um, I could just have the Discord bits pop up. Um, the actual center of here works as a temporary border around the image, but I could potentially do something more detailed later. But yeah, as we can mainly see, it's just my main issues here. Um, is that the bottom area where the tech stuff, like recent sub, recent donor, blah, 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 blah. They're not very legible, or at least to me, looking through the preview. So, let's, let's touch that up. Let's have a look. So, looking at that, obviously it'll be a bit harder to show. But let me, let me go back here. Is if I went back to here... Informative text, recent don't know. Don't know what you're talking about. Unlike how far the text was going, the issue in li there lies as the actual settings of the text itself. Maybe the font is a bit too fancy. Not too sure. But I think could be the Highlights as well. Uh, text shadow. I've got a text shadow there, so... I could increase the shadow. Uh, make it... If I made it bold, I'm worried that'll make the text too thick. Let's go dynamic font size and just see what happens. If I increase the letter spacing... Boom, ba -da -dum, ba -dum. boom, 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 boom. Let's just go bold. Uh, so we can try out bold with a bit more line spacing. Uh, change the height. Change the... Oh, I can't change the size because now it's dynamic. Because I'm a fucking fool. Um, I could change the color. This is a bit... Uh, got a higher saturation maybe. Because the background here for these images is obviously not as dark, but I think the darkness probably actually works quite well. So let's do that as a test, just visually, see what it looks like. So if I got this, obviously I don't care for the actual tattoo bit. I just want the dark multiplay sort of multiplay? Multiplay. Oh, yes, let's do art, but multiplayer. Let me grab this bottom bit, because that's important. Uh, a little bit more. There we fucking go. Control C, Control V. Now I want this to be an overlay as well at like 70%. Now let's see how much this helps when we move it. Uh, that helps there, but it doesn't help there. Is it because of where I've layered things? It could be. So... 
I'm getting the fuck out of here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, let's move this up. Move this up again. Move this up again. Move this over here. And then. Now I can go here. And let's lower it a bit. But yeah, so see how that's going to make that just that bit nicer, I think. That might be what we're looking for. So I might do something with that. So if we ignore, obviously that's got that text bit there, but I can move, remove the text from, where, which layer have I got the fucking text? Oh, not on, not on this one, do I? Oh, I'm a fool. Oh, I do, I do, I do. There we go, I can remove the text. Mm, but I add some shading. Oh dear. Let's remove the text. Let's just grab that. Should I? Nah, I can be fucked. Grab the top bit, where the rose is, a bit lighter. Uh, canvas, trim, canvas by selection. Then we go export as a PNG, top, uh, top tat boy. That's what we'll name it. Then, um, I mean, I can just control C from here as well, just in case I need it. Control V, overlay. Let me go uh, lower the amount and move it. Control D, select something properly. Oh, damn, that fits pretty well. Look how that fits in the box. Obviously, I'd probably want to slightly reshape it. How does it fit here? Perfect. Fuck. That went well. Um, yeah. I would probably want to change slightly where the shading is, maybe, so that, because I'm thinking about once I slowly actually make the lighting and make it a lot nicer and neater, the lighting will come from the top right. Um, so I want more actually light-based stuff to pop through. Though in reality, my actual lighting's coming from technically top right and behind and above, Ugh. and in front, four-point lighting. It's meant to be three-point, but I was too lazy to turn the other light off. But, but, <laughs> bottom. I went there. Mm, I think I don't want to lower it too much. I like the texture that's already there. I just want to make sure the chat's legible. So if I do something like this, and it's just delete this. Now this fella here, I'm going to go control A, control C, control V, V. Then I'm going to move that there. I'm going to move this one here. I'm going to move this one here. Now, I think what the best idea is if I put them all together. So if I go merge and merge, then they're in that same boat, I think. Uh, this is at 62%. Let's put this up to 100 so that when we merge them, merge, make sure this is normal so they're all the same type. And I go merge, then I go overlay there. So they should all be around the same type now. So that overlay bits, it'll be a bit neat. No, no, no. Words. <laughs> They'll be a bit neater, nicer. And so I think that should help with the overlay. Probably switch it to art, but I am just rambling mainly. So to presume I'm doing art would be very <laughs> bold of me. But let's figure out where did I put the new... Not the runes, not the borders. Runes, runes, borders, borders. Do 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 do. So I mean, that's where those are. But I want to figure out. Is that? Ooh, where did I put it? But I think for now, at the very least, if I do this, I'll need to do that top one. Unless I want to light it up, light it up, lit up. Fuck words, suck. Um, hmm, hmm, thoughts, thoughts, thoughts. There are too many of them, and not enough time. I think for now, let's just do this. Let's go all the way back up to uh, the box stone, right box stone, left box stone, and I go back up here. So this is 
so the selection is okay there. Then what I want to do is selection, invert selection. So now anything outside those boxes is not needed. Get the fuck out. Get the fuck out of here. And in theory, there we go. So they're in the box size. Everything's okay. Ish. Why is there that white line? Eh, whatever. Can't be fucked. Oh, that's going to annoy me. I mean, you guys can't really see it, so that's okay. But if I do that, that means when I have the actual overlay, it'll be a bit neater and nicer. Which I do have to think about. Because if we look at the old text test again, um, it's a lot lighter. Obviously, like that. And the issue was having the, te the text legible. And so that should fix the legibility. Yeah. Uh, that top area, should I do the same thing is a real question. Uh, and the good thing about this is now I can just customize and change this and just re-input, export the images if needed for the overlay. Um, so that should work. That, that'll help. I do want to do those. I want to grab this CV. Let's move that there. Um, let's go back down to here, do this, go back all the way back and up, selection, invert, selection, D, control D, and there we go. So now at the very least, we got this, that I want to change a little bit separately, so I'll keep the layers separate, because I probably want that lighter, it'll be higher up. But I also want to figure out why these two have gaps and these two don't. That'd be ideal. Um, but I think for now it's okay. Oh, no. Visually, if I look at it on screen, I can see it. It's a bit more annoying than I would like. So if we went back to here, went back to here, selection, dilate, selection one pixel, then delete. Wait, no. Oh. Yeah, if I did that, that won't work. So let selection's the outside. I want to erode this section. Control Z. Selection erode by one pixel. Then delete. Control D. That's a bit nicer. Um, if we then... Yeah, I like that a bit more. Um, the bottom area is okay. Obviously, the main issue I'm having here is... I will probably need to flip the image here because if I want the lighting from the top right, the lighting here is in the wrong spot. And so I think the best option for me before I do any actual custom lighting is I want to adjust the image that is naturally there before I start doing any other changes. Um, so if I select this picker here, um, I can reverse vertical, no, reverse horizontal. I think that works a bit better. Um, but that has the lighting at the bottom there. Let's control Z. Let's do reverse vertical. Do I prefer that? I think I do, because that puts the lighting at the right, which makes more sense. Um, and then, because of that, I can also do this again. Um, and if I... Hmm... I can go back to here, Control c Control Control d I want to go back up to here, I think. Control v I'm going to move this back to here because I think the issue I was having with both here and here was that it slightly wasn't the right size. So then I want to go back all the way down, give it a good old select. Then I want to do selection invert. Then I want to erode the selection one pixel. I want to go all the way back up here. All the way. All the way. Wherever the fuck it is. Because I forget to name the layers. Because I'm a fool. Delete it. Control D. There we go. That fixed it. Um, ish. 
Let's do overlay. Do that. Having that central area darker makes sense logistically, but I don't know if I want to do it. I'm going to do it for now, see how it goes. Um, doing them individually makes sense, but I do need to get rid of this old one. Then I can go back to this one and bump it the fuck up. And there we go, we've solved the issue. So now that extra bit of light there is no longer an issue. The issue will actually, oh, but I'll need to flip it again. Well, then that's fixed already ish. Well, there we go. So we got the, that on the right side. This one over here to the left is the overlay. Oh, no, that just flipped the overlay though, which isn't what I cared for. I want to flip the actual image, which is down here, isn't it? It is. Yes, it is. I do say, I do say. I mean, it looks like it's in the right spot. But where's the left one? I put that in a folder. That shouldn't be too hard to find. He says for five minutes. <laughs> nah, I think. Oh, that should be everything. Yeah, if I do control A, reverse Hori. Oh, uh, yeah, I remember. That was that would be the issue if I was going to reverse it horizontally. Then I would also have to change the actual lighting a bit. Which is annoying. Definitely. But if I did that, it would fix a few problems light wise. Which is good. But I don't want to edit around again. Ah! What have I done? Eh! Yeah. Mm -hmm. How does reversing it horizontally change it back to its original image? I'm not complaining. But I'm confused how it's like, yeah, yeah, that's the original image. We'll do that. That was deleted. <laughs> I mean, I'm not complaining, but what the fuck? What the fuck? Sure, okay, let's do that. That makes life a bit easier. Get rid of that. Uh, the image on this spot here, if I look at it, is quite clearly the bottom left. So I want to probably... Reverse it horizontally, reverse it vertically. So that makes it there. And horizontally. Damn, what the fuck's happening? That's so weird. That's kind of funny. I am so confused. Like, I am beyond confused right now. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm beyond confused. How does an image, you're rotating it, it goes from cropped, Uncropped, flipped to three individual <laughs> images. Oh my gosh, what? Obviously, I know the old ones here, but I'm not. What? How is that then cropped as well? Like, just for reference, I do not have anything as a mask layer anymore, so that shouldn't be cropped anymore. Or anything. That's so confusing. Um. Okay, sure. You do what you want to program, I guess. Um, what I d will need to do, I guess, then, is I'll need to move it down. I guess. Um, sh oh, babe. Well, that makes more sense. Okay, so it's a whole image that was cropped, and that's why flipping it around did that, because that's the original image there. Oh, I get it now. It's just, it was outside. Oh, I'm stupid. Well, I already knew I was stupid, but I'm extra stupid. So, now that we've got the whole image, it makes more sense. The issue, lighting is top right. So if I reverse it horizontally, we fix that. But the corners won't be the same. So we can actually just crop out a new spot. If I lower it down here. Do, 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 do. Now what I want to do is I want to grab this motherfucker here. Um, but I really got to figure out, is this, 
Is that the right spot? That is. Perfect. So now if I do that, um, let's just to make sure change selection delete it because I'm already here. Why not? Selection invert. And then if I move back to here, I can just delete it. Where the fuck is it though? Let's find it. Where is it? Do, 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 do. Ah, wrong one. No. Left box stone. Delete. Control D. How's that going? There we go. Oh, the image. I'm going to need to get a little closer. Let's have a, let's have a snip. So here, it is starting to go a little bit too much into some of these spots. Control Z, Control Z. Let's go selection. Go back to what it was. And then delete it. Control D. Okay, so that's a bit better. So in theory, if I did this, I can go back, turn this back on. And obviously it's got the little rose pattern that's hidden amongst it. Rose, 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 rose. Well, nice little hidden roses there. Um, then you've got sort of the lighting is technically there. So that automatically, if we have a look, we can see that that looks a lot better like already. Just because I changed the direction of the natural, where the natural lighting was on the image. So we're sort of there. Obviously, that fixes things. The actual gradient of the original lighting here, that's fine. That I'll need to change slightly, maybe, which would require downloading image, changing it, blah, blah, blah. It'll, that would just be a lot of time that I don't know if I can be fucked to, to look into just yet. So it's okay. I'll just presume it's working good enough-ish. Let me know if it does actually look shit. But, you know, we'll see it, guys. Then I guess the next thing to look into is how much of an improvement is it? And why is my jaw always hurting? Oh, wait, that's because it's trying to break. Jaw crack time. Oh, boy. Get myself one of them, them, their damn fucking cracks. Um, yeah, so let's just turn off this background image just to have a look. So, as a concept, this looks okay. There's a lot more that can be improved. Um, we've got, I think the real thing that needs more improvement neatly, if I look at it, is the actual image itself for now. Because the image itself is a bit too, too two-dimensional, I guess. The extra chat box can be fixed. Text can be fixed outside of it a bit better. Um, hmm. Because once this is actually set up well enough, I can then technically move it around to try and make it for the other overlays as well. Which will take time as well, but as does anything. Let's figure out these cogs here. Um, how do I want to make them nicer? I think is a real issue. I could import the original image and make it an overlay so they're a bit thicker. Wait, I think I just solved it just then. Let's try that. So obviously the original image, when I use this overlay properly, uh, that's one of the ones under the CCL uh, Creative Commons license, but it is the, the cogs require a credit, so I'll put it on the credit spot until I make my own. Um, and then everything else I've just made myself or doesn't require it. But I'll still put it up for the actual the nice marble. Uh, the tattoo-y thing I made, but the actual marble itself, the OG stone. I'll just put a credit in for that, because that's a damn good picture. So the fact that that's Creative Commons is good. Um, so I think upgrading this picture and the cogs are probably the next thing I want to look into, just to see how it works. What I want to see is... Let's go... Is this it? Give it a second. That's going to take a hot minute. There it is. So that's the OG picture. If I was to do this, 
that, 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 that. Section invert control C. If I went back to here, I'm gonna go all the way up to the top around where those things are. Now, if I went back to where my other overlays are at the time being, move away, browser pop up. We're not listening to you. Control V. Where the fuck did I put that image? Eh? Uh, C. V. What the fuck? Um, is the selection incorrect? Control C, Control V. That's correct there. What's the size of this image? Maybe I'm underestimating how big that is. And it just needs enlarging. Does anyone else actually see that? I'm confused. Where is it? Because in theory, this should be fine. But it isn't... What? Mm -hmm. Um, control C, control V. Yeah, because, like, that's copying. I am confused. I am confusion. Let's do control C. Oh, uh, control A, control C. Let's grab the whole image, including the area around it. Go back out, control V. There we go. Damn, that's fucking thick. I don't think I want them this big. Um, I want to make sure it's the right, I mean, I can just scale it to what the image is on there. That's true. No. 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 It's going to be fucking real distorted soon. No. There we go. So now let's slowly get this to the size that this is, because I don't remember what size I made it, because I'm a genius. Oh, I think it's just also I didn't expect to come back to this just yet. A bit wider. It's okay. I still need... Why? Why have those white lines come back? Okie dokie, I guess. Funny bit wider. A little bit thicker for everyone. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I mean... That's sort of right. Maybe it's off. Zooming in time. Let's get real fucking nitty gritty. Let's, all right, so in theory, that's around there. It is still a bit too small. Because so I can just line up that inner circle-ish. If I was to do that, okay. What's off? And I do see. Everything's better down where it's wetter. Interesting, I do say so myself. Doesn't need to be too accurate because I just want to enhance the image that we got going here. But it does need to be somewhat accurate. Maybe. Oh, uh, let's see. I do. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Let's line up this inner circle, see what happens. Line that up a bit. Obviously that's inaccurate, but you know. What be the issue? My brain's the issue, I guess. I mean, that's pretty accurate, if we look at it. Um... And yeah, that's, that's pretty accurate now. any more than this doesn't it's like yeah it's okay if anything i can probably do that a bit obviously that was my custom edition because i thought the image just cut it out a bit too much but if we did this now let's say it's fine 
what I'll need to do is, I think, edit it for where these bits are. So the main thing to do is let's make a backup layer, copy, and hide, hide that, select that. So then we got a backup. We're good. Now I need to select everything except where it is. Or I can select it. It's, they're the two options, I guess. Select that and that. Uh, hmm. Do 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 do. Uh, no, no, no. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Now, obviously, I'm gonna figure out what I want to do. I want to figure out where's the middle border. That'll be good. I can lasso some things, but I want to figure out where the border is because it'll make it a bit easier. Corner, 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 border, border. I think that's for the chat border. Cog concepts don't need that. I'm not looking for the box borders. That's on the OG overlay, isn't it? That is. That's the issue. So if I did that. Um, similar colored pixel, range of similar colors, let's lower that. Do, 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 let's lower that a bit. That's okay, it's at least doing its job. Uh, that's a bit too much though. Let's do that. Mmm, too slow, too slow. Think honestly, it might be easy if I just do this and that and that that do 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 boop 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 boop. select pen. I don't have my tablet out, but it'll help a bit. There we go. I mean, and that's the issue for not having the cogs on a separate layer. But I mean, that's because I put the cogs in the original PNG that I downloaded when I made this in a different software. That's on my fucking, that's my fault. Let's increase that to 34. What happens? Nothing negative, so we're going okay. Ba -do -do. Ba -dum -dum. No, I don't. Nope. 20, go. That's alright. It's living the dream there. We go there. Then we go here. We go here. I'll see it. I'll see it. I'll see it. I'll see it. Then we go there. Ah, oh, juicy. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, bum, bum, bum. Hello there, you little thing. Come on. Okay. Oh, I know this song. Yeah, I know all of them. I've played them on quite a bit. Um, boom, 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 boom. I look forward to when I've got the old actual music that's made. But that's expensive. I've only got the starting one under commission at the moment. Don't tell you one. Shush. It's a secret surprise. But yes, I should have my own starting music at some point in the future. It should be cool. I look forward to it. I think what I could do, I need to do select a razor maybe. That might be quicker. 
Or I can use the lasso. Um, let's go. Holy. Well, 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 well. Oh, no, no, no. Don't you dare. Select pen. Well, no. I mean, that's a bit slower and tedious, but it's at least accurate and relaxing. Oh, well, I break my fucking back, I guess. Do, do. Click, 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 click. All right, I see what you're doing there. Bit more, thank you. Bit. Oi, 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 oi. No. All right, I guess you don't want to be selected. Oh dear. Uh, hey, I see you. Give me that juicy. There we go. Oh, well, this is good. Um, select. Doop doop doop. Bing 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 bong. Bing bing bong. Oh. Uh, ah, that's annoying. Oh, there we go. Straight line town. Fucking. What a banger. Select the razor. Why not? Select the razor. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, I didn't want the actual razor. No. Dang it. Select the razor, please. Good. There we go. Let's lower this down. Do 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 do. Um, no, 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 no. Because I can always just reselect some of those bits, but I want to just do that first. Then go back to here. Will that pick that up? No, not yet. It won't. Uh, ah, so there are some bits down there that are being a little cheeky. No, actually, that's fine. Because we're just looking away from those things. So let's just get rid of this for now. New cogs. Just go invisible for the moment. It'll make things a little easier. And go all the way back down. Let's look at the old cogs and look at the new spot. Nope. So I want to get everywhere except where the cogs are. Could select the cogs, it might be quicker. But I don't know if I can be fucked anymore. I've already started this. So why not, I guess? It's nice and relaxing to do this too. While I just ramble me head off. Oh, that's juicy. Oh, that's going fucking right in there. Nature's all right. All right, there we go. That's good, that's good. No, don't go there. Uh, how's everyone going at the moment? Everyone vibing? Just let me know if you want volume changes or anything. I'm just chilling. No. I would like that to go back to doing that. Thank you. Uh, select pennant. Why not? Probably a lot quicker. If I just do this. <laughs> probably a lot quicker, I'm going to be honest. And then I'll just go. Instead of that, I'll just deselect some spots. Because that's selected. Should be fine if I do that. Uh, these cogs I will now pay attention to. But that's a different image. So that should be alright. If I did this properly and had the cogs on a separate layer and a separate image, I wouldn't have this issue. But I guess we live and learn. I'm cracking my jaw. Do, do, do. Zip, 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 zip. Just go all the way along everything else. Because why not? Do, 
So it's just all of this spot here. And so would it be quicker for me to deselect spots? Potentially. I don't know. Uh, let's zoom back in. Boom, 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 boom. Let's move some of the things that y'all can't see. I can actually see what I'm doing. There we go. Doom, 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 doom. Let's get rid of that. There we go. Mm, too much. Too much. Let's go to a twenty-two percent tolerance. Twenty percent tolerance. Uh, it's still too much. Fourteen. Uh, it's better, I guess, but I think it's still not enough. Sixteen. Getting that. Eighteen. Oh, uh, 20. There we go. That's okay enough to not blur things, I guess. Because it doesn't matter too much, because it's just going to be an extra sort of like multiplied overlay to make the cogs stand out a bit more. But still, a bit of a pain. Now, let's just get off some of those cogs. Let's go around. I'm just going to go around the edges. But yeah, I'm going to just select everything and deselect spots. I think that's probably the easiest now. Because, honestly, it's a little bit annoying. Hmm. Try selecting the images of myself. Eighty hey, go. Hmm. Forty two go. Not too bad. Not too shabby. Like that's good work. Pretty well. Especially if I lower this down. Man forgets how to use layers. Properly, you know, forgets what he'll probably want to do later. I guess it's simply because when I originally sort of downloaded and designed this in the other program, I was presuming I would just add borders to these cogs and not add another overlay. So I didn't think I'd want to select these. But, you know, I guess I did. Move the pop out of the way, move the layer out of the way, not if you guys can see it. How does that how well does that work? So if I'm doing something like that. How do I want to do this? I'm dumb. So I selected that. I mean that's good enough for now, I guess. Hmm. That's. I don't want to do this. That's the real question. Because it is proving to be a little finicky. So, do I want to select these? Or do I want to select the cogs? I could do one at a time, but that's a bit tedious. I'm so lazy. 
I mean, if I had my tablet, that could help. I didn't expect to be doing this. And boom, boom, boom. Remember, 18 is the sweet spot. I just want to get these little grooves. Because that's going to be important. Because I don't want to do them all by hand. That's going to take some time. So I'm just going to go around these inner bits here. Maybe. I don't know. Let's keep going. I should get my tablet if I'm going to be doing this. Oh, that's all right. No, let's not do that. Boom, 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 boom. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I'm really hoping that if I can get this sorted, that'll make making other overlays a little bit easier. That'll be fun. Because I'm looking forward to having a bit more, a better overlay, better setup. It's a process, it's fun. Takes a hot second there. Hmm. No, I don't like it. No. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh huh. Now what I want, uh, the annoying thing is if I'm doing the lasso, it'll individually do what I'm looking at. Mm, so I either got to stick to this or at least stick it differently. There we go. Sneak that. Grab that. Do, 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 do. Because, you know, got to figure out the Beth, mes Beth method. I guess the best method. Gotta figure out what the best method is without me being stupid and having the cogs there. Because <laughs> I've really fucking bugged me up here, eh? Because oh. I think I'm just gonna have to do it by hand if I don't want to be doing this for ages. I mean, it's fun, relaxing. I don't know how much everyone else wants to just see me. Select parts of the image because of my mistakes. That's all right. As long as everyone's also enjoying it. We do be vibing. Boom. Oh, yeah. Nah. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Ha. Do that. Take that. I can tog. Well, the cogs aren't going to go out too much. So I don't need to worry too much about that. The issue is where the cogs overlap. So maybe I'm overthinking it. There's no point trying to delete an area where the cogs, the new cogs won't be. I just need to fig figure out where the cogs would be. That's a bit smarter, Liam. Well done, you're using a brain. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That should be alright. Because even if I delete some of that, that should be okay. Because I can also just... Hey, there we go. See, perfect. As all things, no, 
That's not perfect. What have I done? I am a fool. Blink, 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 blink. The words of a philosopher. Blink, 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 blink. Oh, it's doing okay. Not what I'm looking for, though. Get over here. Good shit. And get over here, it did. I'm proud of you, Mr. Cog. Ow, fucking cramp. Ow. What the fuck, mate? Thanks, Beck. Appreciate it. I'm used to pain, but Beck's trying to fucking jump scare me. I'm used to pain all the time, not jump scared all the time. Uh, boom, 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 boom. Is that covering all the areas I would like? It is. That should be okay. I wonder if, if I do that, will that then get that? No, it won't. I mean, it almost will. Pretty good. What program am I using? So, the main program I use for art, normally I, uh, is, uh, let's just open something that I would normally do with my art programs. Because normally I use for painting and any art like that. If I also get up a, what was the random sketch I did a day or so ago? If I can find it. Um, yeah, so when I'm normally doing art and stuff like that, um, I use Paint Tool Sci too. Um, I do enjoy that quite a lot. So whenever I do something normally like Monday sort of sketches or just randomly any sort of art, um, paint tool size, the main one. Um, mainly I've been using it for sketches on Mondays or anything else, but I used to do it a lot more for actual full on painting, which I'm, I'm, I'm practicing getting back into it. Um, so yeah, paint tool side two is the main one for actual art for this overlay. To make it a bit cleaner, because I'm very bad with clean, crisp drawing and art and stuff like that. Uh, you've, I've used three things. Um, so I used Paint.net, Paint Tool Sci, and Google Slides. Because Google Slides is very good snapping. So you can use Google Slides to get the shapes and what you, the, the geometrics sort of set up. And then... You can download that as a PNG, making sure it's at the right aspect ratio and shit. Um, then you can go into paint.net to sort of just like, if you want to do any other basic little bits and bobs. And then for more finicky art sort of stuff, I put it into my art program that I normally use for painting, which is this. Um, yeah, so at the moment I'm using paint tool sci. But I'm very bad with very neat, clean stuff, so... Uh, Google Slides is very good for that. If that helps and makes sense. Oh, I broke my jaw. Oh, never mind, that's my neck. But yeah, so normally on Mondays, I do more painting and art and stuff like that. Monday is my time, because I don't know what time everyone's in. I know that's Sundays for Googly. Um, interesting, never heard of it. Yeah, so the main ones, if you're doing like sort of digital painting and stuff, the main ones people tend to recommend is Procreate, Clip, paint, Clip Studio Paint, Clip Paint Studio, whatever it is, or Paint Tool So. Unless you've actually got like an income, then you can do um, Photoshop because, but Photoshop's a subscription, whereas Paint Studio and Paint Tools are a single pur purchase for the license. So that's why they are a bit more reasonable and usable. Uh, and generally speaking, I just like Sai quite a bit. 
I've always found it works well for what I'm doing. Um, normally, like I'm, I'm still trying to get used to digital art again. It's been a long time. Time. It's been a long time since I've properly done it. I'm still getting back into the swing of things. Um, but I guess I'm also still getting into the swing of properly streaming as well. I'm getting there. Trying to get that balance between testing out and trying out the new things and looking after not dying. Actually, my body seems to like trying the opposite. But, you know, it's all right. Um, so that's why I'm not, I don't do like art all the time and stuff because I don't do like FPS that often. Adobe Suite, yeah, 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 Adobe Suite. Um, it's pretty sweet. Um, yeah, no, that makes sense. Yeah, Adobe Suite works pretty well for people. Um, but yeah, no, I haven't, I don't have that. It's sort of just like, okay, what do I want to use? But there's no point for me getting Photoshop because it's not like digital art will turn into a main, um, uh, whatever you want to call it. A main source of income because well, one, I'm not very good at it, and two, I can't really do it a lot. Um, and so it's like, it doesn't make sense. So it's just for fun. I mean, I guess a bit like streaming and stuff too. It's just that's good fun. I like meeting people, I like just you know, creating a nice community, just vibing with people. I think. Yeah. Oh, what's the time? Twelve forty. Okay. Soon will be the little bit of a break. Not because I need a break this early. Normally I don't, but it's because I have to go and do things briefly. But I will be back later once I do go. Um, as per usual. I'm here most every day. Five days a week. Most of the, at least probably like four hours a day. Almost full time these days. A full time hobby of meeting friends. Uh. I don't want that. That's all right, though. Boom, 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 boom. How's this all going? I think it's okay. There's a few bits and bobs that I'll need to get. But as a general, I think it's working. Just try and get all the spots where it's going to be a pain in the ass. Uh, yes, silly thing. Bye. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Smile on my head. Do you like do art or something? Is like main schooling or something? Uh, or is it just sort of for fun, or... Yeah, what do you tend to do, Rival? It's more like graphic design, art, your own just thing, just vibing. I don't know. Well, no real particular thing at the moment, I guess. Um... Bam. That's okay. How's this going? Uh, I do want to get rid of these white bits because they are annoying as fuck. Select Ben. Do your thing, bitch. Into school here in the US for graphic design. Oh, you're awesome. Just graduated and currently working at the college. Still in their design studio. Oh, awesome, man. 
congrats. Well, well done for graduating. No, oh, that's awesome. Um, you happy how you went? You still enjoy it and stuff? Because obviously some people go into it and they just for the skills. Some people go into it and aren't a fan. But yeah. What sort of got you into it as well, I guess? I do need to learn some more graphic design stuff because that'll make a lot of this easier. Understanding more graphic designy bits. At the moment, my small brain's just figuring it out. I guess with any of the stuff required, it's just like, oh yeah, that needs doing. I'll figure it out. It either works or it doesn't. I mean, that's half the fun. I like streaming the confusion of trying to figure out everything. And to see how it goes. Um, that should be okay, I think. And jump. Just interested in the process. Yeah, that makes sense. It is, yeah, it is very interesting to try and figure out, like, like just some of the raw sort of concepts of it and how much certain things affect whether something looks nice, whether something, yeah, there's so many, like, interesting things that you don't realize until you look more into it, how much a lot of things affect it and impact it. Um, it's very interesting. So, no, I definitely get that. Um, yeah, it took you two years to figure it out. Um, if that is what is you interested in, yeah, yeah, no, that makes sense. Like, and like a lot of people, it takes them like, I can't remember the actual like fucking like numbers. So, disclaimer, I'd take it as a grain of salt. But yeah, it's one of those things where it's like, this people switch between their jobs like many times throughout their life anyway. And it's, the only way to really figure out if you like something is to try it, I guess. And it's one of those things where it doesn't hurt to know anyway. That's why I used to do like chefing and baking and masseusing and stuff like that is even if I didn't keep doing those, uh, they're useful skills. And that's sort of one of the things I've really liked. While I've always been passionate in streaming and voice acting, one of the things I've liked about trying to understand it more and so I can not only just do it better, but also for my own intriguement and trying to learn it it's one of those things that um it teaches you so many different things you sort of have to unless you're happy with just sort of things being at a like not really optimal thing if you're someone like me who always likes to try and just touch on things consistently it's a very good way to learn a lot of different skills at the very least at their basic level because it's helped me understand a bit more graphic design like the 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 f thing I don't know if there's a technical term for it, but it's like how, at the very least in Western culture, how you read things in a pattern of a capital F. Well, it's like F, F down. And then, yeah, you could always branch out. And at the very least, you've still got those skills as well. And nothing stops you from coming back to it because you've got those skills. Um, and yeah, so it's like recently, like learning about the F thing for a while ago when I was doing a little bit of just, just some basic story writing because I was curious. Um, was because I like writing and stuff like that on a more, and I, I'm not, not like a whole story level, but I am curious about it. it. was like, that's where I learned more about how much font impacts things, what sort of fonts are good, for what reason. So that's why I really like, that. that's where I learned a bit more about font. Um, and then more recently, been trying to learn about, I learned more about the F thing for being like, okay, cool. That's why a lot of streamers, especially like VTubers and stuff, they have the, screen at the top left because capital F was like screen and then you put the things bottom so in that sort of capital F shape it helps a bit better um and I wanted a bit cleaner because what we've got here for the art one was just my my scribble overlay of just getting ideas down so that was actually more hand painted compared to this one which is more graphic designy um and I want to eventually mix the two of them so it's even more personalized 
But yeah, and no, that's one of those things where nothing can. Oh, so many fucking potatoes. Thank you very much. Yeah, and that's why I've also like I want to learn go back to doing more voice lessons, and I want to go back to doing singing lessons because, and that's why I'm learning. Like one of the benefits of learning language is like it's helpful for voice acting and acting and stuff because you understand using your own voice more, and it's like I like using those skills that'll work together a bit more. But no, it's really cool. Um, yeah, graphic design is very interesting. So oh, good on you for sort of sticking to it, and hope that continues to go. Off. Oil for you, man. And thank you for the fucking potatoes. That's some good shit. Um, <laughs> but yeah, no, I think if you were to branch out into things, what do you think you'd branch out into? Just do you think you'd still be in the this sort of area of graphic design? Do you think you'd stick to a different area? Or you just don't know? Because for me, it was an in interesting mix of uh, I went into chefing and baking for the wrong reason. I did it because I like making people happy, and food is one of those ways where I like art, and I like making people happy, and I was able to use food to sort of do that. But the chefing industry is less about that. It's more about the like enjoying the creation of the food and that. And I like all the, that sort of stuff, but I didn't like how toxic the industry can be. Um, and then obviously my health collapsed, which allowed my fucking uh, hobbies to be more justifiably my main passion, um, which is interesting, but that's one benefits from it, I would say, because uh, as much as the extra health issues are bad, at the very least, I can pursue the stuff that I'm really passionate about. A bit more, obviously. Yeah, it's not. It's not something that I'm aiming for, like, or I'm not really presuming it's going to turn into anything. But it's fun. I want to make like at the very. I just want to make a nice community where I can everyone just can support each other and be happy. And I just want to be able to, I don't know, do what I enjoy. I enjoy the art. I enjoy learning things. I enjoy language. I enjoy voice acting. And I. It's sort of, and streaming just sort of like does all of that. Um, as much as there are a lot of negatives, at least it's provided me reasonable, <laughs> like, a, 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 to provided me time to be able to do things. Best memory from your time baking? Um, yeah. I don't know. Um... Uh, it's either just the memory of like the friends or the people like that I worked with or when I was doing when I had to do um a twelve course or for the last I think it was like the last part of the chefing um course this, this whatever said I think it is. Um, I had to, the whole sort of team of the apprentices and stuff, we had to all do a plan and make a 12 course degustation menu. And I enjoyed, um, potato. Thank you. Uh, no, thank you. Uh, but yeah, no, I, I think I enjoyed, um, that whole environment of making that, working in that really nice area and making lavender ice cream was surprisingly really nice. Uh, Thank you. Uh, and so having lavender ice cream, um, making that, and that was, it just sort of tasted like the feeling of smelling lavender in like a bath or something like that. And then having that with lava cake was just really nice. Uh, it was a fun process. I always enjoyed making eclairs, macarons, uh, Danish pastry, like that sort of stuff I really enjoy. Eventually down the line, if this becomes something I can justifiably put a lot of time into, and have the money to then do fun things like collabs and events and stuff like that. One thing I'd want to do is have an overcooked theme sort of thing. So instead of it actually being playing the game overcooked, you just have people over in a kitchen. Obviously, I don't really have a setup for that at the moment. But if I did, the idea would be you could have people like over in a cool like put a collab with other streamers or whatever 
and with that you could do that and sort of call it like sort of like over like something to do with overcooked overcooked with or like with something or i don't know and then you just sort of i don't know have a fun little just chaotic streaming thing involving chat and stuff um and technically because i got green screen and everything you could set up for vtubers um because overcooked is hilarious so doing that in a real sort of streamer setting would be hilarious if it could be manageable um so trying to incorporate that would be fun um now like uh what else would be so like you could do that that'd be really interesting um i don't know i just want to create a nice sort of community where it's supportive and just i don't know it's just fun like i don't i don't care for being like, i just want it to be sustainable enough so i can i know that i'm not going to if i can <laughs> cripple myself any more than i already am but also to know that um like i can then just create a nicer environment for everyone too like i don't know because it's something i enjoy and just enjoy doing all these things so if i, if I can make other people happy and help other people through whatever they're dealing with that's the sort of end goal for me whether that be through funny weird collabs whether that just be through my own just chill vibes i don't know um at one stage i do want to if i do manage to learn to sing uh that'd be fun to try and collab and do singing with someone i do want to do a dumb karaoke stream because if i uh, there's a lot of ideas i have because <laughs> that'd be hilarious like i'm not good at singing and my voice has been damaged for quite a while so being able to do a dumb karaoke stream would be hilarious but you got to find what songs are under the CCL Creative Commons license. Uh, there's a lot of little intricate bits that uh, I couldn't really manage at this point in time. Because a lot of my time either goes into just chilling, because I'm still new to streaming, figuring that out. Definitely the chill vibes. Yeah, that's what helped you. Yeah, yeah. Well, I, yeah, I definitely want to continue, like, just having that nice chill vibe that people can go to and just know that, like, even if it is like a parasocially sort of thing, know that like they're still like I don't know as a in a weird like in a parasocial way, I still want to like help support people and care for people. I want to learn more. I want to get fluent in some more languages so that I can help people through other languages as well. Um, I've been learning Thai for a little while. I'm starting to get there. Obviously, it being a tonal language, and then Australian. The Australian accent naturally is a rising tone, can be a little bit difficult, and with all my voice issues, um, more jaw issues, because Thai is five tones. So when you then go, because um, common tone is like, uh, it's just sort of like it's a, it's the middle thing that just goes as a flat line. It's linear forever. Then you got uh, low. Or it's not drops. Yeah. Then you got low tone, which is sort of as if you added a silent D to the end of car, so card, car, up car, card. Then you got dropped, which is more like it's shouted, like an exclamation point, and car. So it's like car, card, car. And then you got high, car. And then you got rising car. So the rising is just naturally Australians always sound like they're ending a question. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah, mate. Oh, yeah, fucking yeah, nah, yeah. <laughs> but, no, uh, yeah. I, I do want to be able to get fluent in other languages. And, I don't know, I really like when I see sort of, like, like groups of whether it be streamers or YouTubers just having a wholesome, nice, fun community. Um, I know I love dumb puns. <laughs> so, if there was ever a VTuber community that was Australian-based, that sort of became a group like I, like you know all of them there's like hollow live v showed all that sort of shit um you could technically say vtubers <laughs> instead of vtubers because that'd be a hilarious pen a uh, pun not pen um i've been distracted adhd moments intensify i guess what was i doing i was going i've selected this this actually should be all, all right if i then go up where the, wherever the fuck that's gonna be going. I go up, 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 and I go here. I've selected those, so in theory, 
in theory. I then delete this. What's your favorite get because I'm a PNG? <laughs> and I would join that and be the funny part. Honorary Australian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's your favorite? Uh, what's your favorite get? Uh, I don't know what you mean by favorite get. So <laughs> maybe I'm just dumb or old or tired or some shit. But <laughs> what's your favorite get? I don't know. I get got. I like get and get. Oh, favorite game. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Autocorrects are fun. Favorite game. Yeah, autocorrects something else. <laughs> uh, favorite game. Fuck. Oh, uh, any as anyone with ADHD would know, <laughs> the second it's like, oh, what are your favorite things? Then you forget you've ever played any game in existence. I guess. I don't know. ADHD just loves ev like everything, uh, and nothing all at the same time. It's weird. Um, it would be easier if I broke it into genres. I'd say favorite survivally builder one would probably be Terraria. That's really fun because I definitely always like the. There's just a lot you can do it. That's always fun. Uh, favorite roguelite is a bit harder. Uh, that would be between Children of Mortar or Moonlighter at the moment. I think. I like that Moonlighter did things differently with it being like, okay, when you're outside of your run, instead of just upgrading, you're actually running a shop. That's fun. I want to play that on stream. But just like anything else I have as a stream game, also known as on my Switch, I have the capture card. My computer's just too old. <laughs> so once I eventually, hopefully, if I eventually then get a better computer, because I need better USB ports and I need a new i fucking motherboard thing, once I get those, then I can stream Switch games. But this intermediate, I'm still starting Switch. Yeah. Austerians, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But, yeah, so if I finally am able to upgrade my computer, which will take time, then I can stream Switch games. Um, Mario Kart's just great. Um, Tower Falls, hilarious. Um, what other games? There's a lot of games. Yo, NZ, how you going, man? Having a good day? You vibing? Are you living the dream? How's this? Sorry, let me just think with me, Noggin. So that makes... So that's the original. If I do this, it slightly makes that stand out a bit better. But I can then technically go screen. Oh, there we fucking go. So let's go out. There we go. Original. And I can go all the way to that. So if I went, just got home, work went slow as. Oh, yeah. That makes sense. How'd that go? Is like work okay at least? Like fun? Ooh, if I go multiply, multiply, not markiplier, fucking. Oh, bronze is nice, but it doesn't have enough contrast. I could go down. I don't know. Uh, let's try over. Oh, that's a bit shiny, which makes sense, I guess. I don't know. Is it right? Hell yeah. Shine? Do I want to make it shiny? Uh, I don't know. I don't want to make it fucking glaring. <laughs> That's nice. I don't know. Shade shine? Oh, yeah, shade shine. Because then I can add the shine and the shade and the shine and the shade and the yeah. Oh, that's yummy. Okay, that could be nice. I don't know. What does everyone think? Because I'm trying to think of how I want to make these cogs a bit nicer. But I'm worried that if I make it too coppery, it'll remove some of the contrast that this original's got. But the original is a bit too... too grey. Obviously, uh, doing that just makes it a bit too blended. That's too fucking SCP. That's cute. That's a nice colour, but it's not exactly what I'm aiming for, because it blurn... blurns? Blurns. I was thinking of blend and blur. Oh yes, if you blur and blend something, it's called blending. Um, I en yeah, I, I enjoy... That's such a nice colour though, what the fuck? Damn, man. I may even just keep that. I don't care if that blends in with the border, because what the fuck? What does everyone else think? I don't know if this is just me, but that's like, that looks nice. That's like some nice rose goldy sort of feeling. I'm going to save this before I fucking lose everything. Now it's 110. 
Um, at 1.30, I'll have to take a fucking break. Not because I want to. Don't worry. I will be back. But it's literally because I need to run down to the real estate agent, get them to sign something, run back, <laughs> um, do two calls along the way, and then deliver something. So literally, it'll be a longer than normal break. It will be like, I'm aiming for an hour. <laughs> but I will be back later. Uh, if you tie that color in somewhere else, the design will work well. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Um, I'm just worried. I may need to, if I do this cog here, um, I may need to just have a stronger border outline for these, uh, box borders. So, but no, thank you. Yeah, Rival, I definitely appreciate it. <laughs> the, the benefit of you doing graphic design is you're able to pull me up on, um, that sort of stuff. So thank you. I do appreciate that. Um, let's find these cogs. I think that's what I want to do next. Let's open. Where the fuck are those cogs? Those are two separate cogs, actually. They're different images. So I'm going to need to open this. Boop. Hell fucking yeah. Um, so what cogs am I using over here? I'm using the fucking... Mm -hmm. My brain. I'm using the end one and the middle one. Yes, yeah, so I'm using the end two, if I'm correct. I am. I'm a nerd. A genius. So if I do this, whoop, I could go control XV and I do this again. Control XV. Now they're on separate layers. I can get rid of those for now. Ooh, good shit. Um hmm. What do I want? I'll do them one at a time, I guess. So let's grab this one. Uh bring it back around this. Hyphen, fuck indeed. Thank you. You woke me up. You woke me up. <laughs> shrinky dinkage. Oh, look at you fucking shrinky dinky, mate. Oh, uh, that's a bit too shrunked. Yeah, it's a bit too shrunked, if you ask me. Ooh, 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 ooh. How's that? That's actually pretty accurate. I did okay there. Uh, out a bit more? How's that? Hmm. Hard to say. Hard to say. Especially when I got the other one there. Do, 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 do. Beep, boop, music. Boop, boop, beep, boop, beep, beep, boop. Hmm. That looks like I've nailed that on the head there. That's all right. That's good. Um, let's move this to eighty percent. With obviously, I need to shape it. But if I go pin light, that colors are in there. And then what I need to do is go back, go here. I need to then go this. Control C, Control V, Control V is not. Got him. I need to resize it. Then I need to go, ah, and then, whoa. There we go. Yummy. There we go. Let's go up there. Let's go out there. Go out there. Uh, go up a bit. Oh yeah, that's all right. Uh, how accurate is that? That's the real question. Hmm. Do 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 do. Hey. That's pretty accurate. Good enough for me. Done. Um, break my drawer a bit for a little while, I guess. 
And then if I did tan light, yeah. So we can see where that overlaps as well. But in theory, let's just bump these to normal for now. Normal. Do -do 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 -do. Normal. A little bit to 77. Oh, yeah, 70 back in 7. Now, I'm going to go back down. Where am I going? Not here. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, ba doom, ba doom. Now I've got Mario Kart on my brain. Don't know why. For some reason that made me think of Mario Kart. No, don't do that. Let's lower that. Let's chip through that there. Go there a bit. Go there. Go up there. Ah, that's all right. Do, 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 do. Bloop, bloop. That's sort of accurate. Do 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 That should be okay. So let's go up here. I probably want to create some backups. Uh, pass for this folder. Bring them up. Bring them up. There we go. Then what I want to do is layer, copy layer, uh, hog minus. So now I've just got one of them, which I can then go and delete the selected area. Control D. Then then what I can do is I can go to like. 80 maybe? What have I got in the other one? 80, yeah. And go 10 light. And let's reset the view. So now, looking here, we've got that sort of over there. There's a bit that I can probably touch up. What did I fuck up over here? Uh, yeah, it's a little bit jittery there. Do that. All right, cool. So, uh, having a look at this, that makes it nice, but mm, not too sure. No, I don't. Uh, I could just slightly lower that. I do like how shiny that is, but I'll do that a tiny bit lower, so that the centerpiece is still brighter. 
because that's the main thing you want the center piece to be where the eyes go to these lines draw the eyes to the center this is the eyes of f f so you'll see this then you'll come and look here and drag your eyes along here these lines will then drag your eyes back up here so it's like you see this you'll see this then you get dragged all the way up how the fuck's my cursor oh no yeah all the way up here um and then that's where you see that so technically your eyes will see everything it'll create a circular motion mm. now i'm curious what i want to put on these edges where this chain is moving in the example let's save this for now now let's look at where i found that fucking old chain because i did have the chain as just a flat example so i can test things uh, it's 1120, okay. Do, 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 do. Top chain idea. Don't oh, fucking scrub me. I did nothing wrong. Alright, obviously that's not how the chain actually looks like. Y'all can see it on the right there. But sizing wise, it's just to give me an idea. Clean design, thank you. Um. Obviously, let's look at what where we got up to yesterday. Ah. So we have technically now improved the chat box when I put it up. And we've improved the cogs and we've improved the information boxes. So with those information boxes, the text will be clearer. Um, now it's about figuring where we want that chain. Do we still want it up the top or somewhere else? And if we still want it up the top, uh, what do we want to do to connect it? So I've got a few thoughts, but that's what I want to, I think the main thing I'm thinking on. I also know at the very top where it's the link tree bit, it's still got the default sort of back shiny bit, which I'll probably want to change at one stage, but it works for now. The discord border bit as well. Uh, I think, yeah, so I think what I want to work on now is where do I want the discord border? And where I want the chains and what I want, to want I want to do with them. Ugh. So let's just go back here. Ah. Now, what is everyone else's thoughts? Because I want to figure out where do I want the Discord box, uh, at least in this design, before I then have to redo every other fucking layout. <laughs> um, what do I want to do with the Discord box and what I want to do with the chain. Um, another thought is if I don't want the chain going along there, I could have it behind the, behind this sort of text box up here. Cause if I have it behind this, it's sort of like, is like as if it's scrolling along it, then it also requires resizing. But either way, that's sort of what I'm thinking of. Cause you've got like, it's either, there's like a chain coming along here Chain moving along here. Two chains, but I think that'll clutter up the design too much. One chain in the middle going up and down. Two chains either side. Uh, two smaller chains or a chain on either side of the screen. So if I was to effectively write up what my thoughts were, um, it's for where we want the chain. Where chain? We got... Top screen. And then we got uh, behind top box. And we got one middle of chat. Uh, behind. Oh no, not two twos. Oh no, it's a two two. <laughs> Then one either side of screen, uh, one either side of border. These are my main thoughts, I guess, of where I want the chain. Then, um, what I probably also want. Let's go 
That's a bit clear. Um, so where chain is probably my thought. And then I also need to think uh, where uh, Discord box. Flash. And that one I don't really need a number. They're my main two thoughts, I think, at the moment. Aside from that, it's actually clearing up the original image, so it's a bit got better contrast. It's a bit neater. Because, say, obviously I don't care about where things are at the moment. If I was to export as a PNG, uh, overlay stream test 7. Um, let's get rid of this. I'm gonna close that. I want to close this. Close, no. Close, no. I'll keep them there in case I need them for something else. Open. Uh, if I open this, this is now just a flat image. Um. <laughs> Substream quality to Jane is now level 25. Thank you. I appreciate that you've leveled up my, my stream design. <laughs> Thank you, Googly. Uh, what are the what are the skill trees I can now go down? What are the tell me the skill paths? Age of Empire me. Age of Mythology me. Show me. Show me. Um, but now looking at this, what I want is to break my jaw off. I guess. What was I thinking? I can't even remember what I was thinking now. Liam, fucking hell. Hmm. Yeah, no, I totally forgot what I was thinking. Uh, where do I want the Discord box and where do I want the chain? Oh, yes. So if I'm looking at this as a PNG. Why did I want to do that? Fuck. I've completely forgotten everything. Um, let me just. As much as I hate Coke, it's useful for my throat right now. Slurp ASMR activated. Um, now, what do I want to do? I guess what do you guys think as well? Uh, I could have the Discord box here. I could not have a Discord box. I could have it. I don't know. That's what I want to think. Is where do we want it? Do we want it? Do we want just a line of Discord? Like, I don't know. I guess that's the next thing. What do we want to do? Because when I'm talking to people in Discord, you're going to have, effectively, a little fucking... I totally forgot there's a shape thing in here. Yeah, so say... How big would the chat thing be? Yeah, maybe let's say it's like that big. It might be a little bit bigger. It might be a little bit smaller. But for this, you would have, like, different people pop up. Uh, so let's color it. I don't know. Let's color it. I don't want it on a shape there. Above chat box, potentially. Um, here, obviously, it won't be seen. But if we move to the older example. So at the moment, I've got the cog box up here the webcam i still want to figure out exactly where i want it and how i want to do it um the actual box itself i'll probably want to change and fix like that's i hate that my monitor is so old that it's on a fucking angle but i mean it's all right hello there but i mean like hey oh, you see some of the pop filter but that's okay I guess. Good enough for now. Let's lower that a bit. I said camera. Let's lower that a bit. Sorry, you're gonna get wiggled for a bit, chat. Ooh, 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 you've been wiggled. Which is okay. You've now been wiggled. It's fucking wrecked. Um, but yeah, as you can see, we've got like the cog thing up there. Um, we've got along with the cog thing up there. The chain was that, that's that original concept of the chain up there. 
Um, obviously, we've now fixed these ch chat boxes, which we can check in a bit. But off to the left, all right, my right, uh, over there. Oh, that is where I got the. That's where the Discord box was originally. Uh, in the concept. So now, if we move back, uh, uh, then if we move back, it's like, okay, where do we want the box? So we've got like the cog up here, probably. We've got like whether it be a whatever model or webcam, we've got it there. This is nice and clean now. Up here, link tree, I think, still works. But where the chain goes will help determine uh, where we want to draw the attention of the eyes. But also, just using this example here. Uh, now this is on a different layer, I can do that. Cool, there we go. So now, uh, let's actually do this. Cool, so say we've got this. Um, let's... Now uh, let's move it, let's get a second one. We probably want to be able to know. Uh, merge it. ACV. Uh, move these ones. So say we've got four people talking at once. It's very rare you would have any more than four people talking at the exact same time. So having it bigger than that is probably not needed. Um, but we can still move this as a test around effectively. Uh, originally, the Discord box uh, could be around here. If we had it around here, how would that interact with the cog? Um, the cog itself takes up a bit of room, and I think that would just feel like it's been... It being on a ledge there just feels like it's getting shoved. Um, especially when the icons will only show who's talking at the same time. Uh, who's talking. If they're not talking, they're not visible. And so if you've only got one, it's sort of... I want something that'll work if only one person's talking or if multiple are talking. Here, if you have it next to the webcam, that makes the webcam, I think, too small. Above it could work here. Um, like it could go like here, webcam. Uh, then it changes the proportions of the webcam. Here could work. And you would only need a slight change to things here. So that could be an option. Uh, so if we went to text here. Um, we could go above, right, box, or we could say left of screen, or we could go back to potentially something else, but they're my first thoughts. I want to change this actually back to that. Thank you very much. Uh, okay, cool. So if we went back here, we've got two options effectively. I'll put, uh, Shape below that. Let's put that there. Let's lower this. Just so it's a bit neater. Do 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 do. Okay, so uh, let's figure out what uh, what does everyone think? Because obviously we got the things in here. Uh, the link tree things up here. Chat's a bit neater. Now I'll figure out what we want with chat there a bit later potentially, but. I don't know. What does everyone else think? Because where, like, where if you guys were seeing Discord people talk, um, where would be best for everyone? We could go here. But I think that makes that too small. That makes it a bit bigger. Go over here. Because I think around here could work. Um, Because top left, people will see it. But do people want to see who's talking all the time? Maybe. And if we're using the rule of, like, if we want people to see who's talking as, like, a priority, you'd put it up here. Less of a priority, the further. Left is, yeah, well, yeah, because you're following the, the capital F rule. Because of the way people view things. Um, yeah, as you would probably know, you, you've studied um, fucking graphic design as well. Uh, people read, at least in Western, uh, in a Western culture sense. Let's go. Uh, oh, I need to make this bigger, I think. Because I'm not using my tablet. In Western culture, people read like this. It goes like that, that, and then that. 
So this is always going to be the focal point. And then the eyes, we're going to go along here. Then the eyes go along here. Then the eyes slowly progress downwards. Um, and so because the webcam is the least of a priority, it's bottom right. And the main camera, the main sort of focal points here. So that's technically top left. The link tree is very important. So it's at the top. So if people are scrolling their eyes, they'll see this. And then the next thing they're scrolling across is here. So natural discord would make sense up there. But I don't want the natural gaze to conflict with um, the cleanness of the de design. Um, but I mean, we could try that and see how that goes. The real question is, do we want a box? Do we want to put them here? Because that could work because there's like a lot of gaps there. So we could technically, I could do that and then we could put like a box there. So it's not interfering with the thing here. So if we did that, that'll be interesting. So I'm going to, oh, so we could try that. I think that's going to be the main thing to try. So what I'll do is I'm going to save this again. Because this is the site. So I'm going to go all the way back to the border. Uh, that's border idea one. And then I get border idea two. Where is the other actual border that's useful? I get rid of them, that's good. Because what that does is that means that I have the border as a separate thing so I can put it above chat. Um, over here is fine. I don't need, like, uh, let's get rid of this. This is an image we'll keep, so maybe I'll keep the text on screen so I know that I'm not keeping it. Um, but at the very least, what I know I'll need to do is figure out the Discord box at the top left, maybe and where i want the chain so if we we could probably incorporate our incorporate our new changes as an image um so give me two seconds i'll just get a spot where we want the chat box to go um so which do people think is better there or in the actual screen i think there so it doesn't detract from what's there and i think below these that's my thought uh, let me know if people think something else. We could go lower. We could go higher. I think potentially there, because that's like one, two, three. Rule of thirds, uh, groups of three, and then that means your eye's going to get caught on the third thing because it wants to follow along this way. So maybe here. So let's try there. Um, <laughs> learning graphic design as we go. Yippee, 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 I-O. Um, so what I'm going to do is... Uh, I could do a window capture. I also don't want to randomly just capture something that I don't want to capture. That's the real thing. Oh no, somebody died. That makes sense. That's a good time. I'm going to go on a break in a, in a jiffy and then be back. Because obviously soon the American audience is going to need a snooze. So that's why it's around a good time for a break and then come back and then it'll be mainly... <laughs> Because a lot of the American audience will be dead unless they're insomniacs. Let's go shape. What sort of shape? Uh, I've got a lot of these sort of shapes. I could go... It doesn't need to be too detailed. But I think if I went a... Um, the snipped diagonal again. That could work well. Obviously, you can't see it yet, because I don't... This is on Google Slides for reference. Uh. Um... Uh, I need to 
make this even, and I'm struggling. Ah! Uh, that's as close as I'll get it, I think. Good enough. So, I'm gonna download this image, I think. Actually, if I just copy that, I could go... Oh, yeah, let's just... May as well do that. File. Uh, download PNG of this image for current slides, so I can open it up here. Once it downloads. Do, 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 do. Open up here. An older, older fucker. And then I can do this. I can go control. Hmm. One way to make sure that this is actually in line. It probably isn't. Let's be real. Now, what I could do is I could go like the halfway point. And that's around here. And copy one half of this. So it's the same as the other half. That would make sense. So do I like the left half more or the right half? I like the right half more, I think. Um, cool. And then here, what I want to do is I want to reverse. But no, I want to reverse horizontally. Then I want to move it. So that. It's over here. If I do this, we now have a good image ish. Because I can now get both of these and move them across. Is that too wide now, though? I mean, that's easy to fix if it is too wide. Which it is a little bit. Let's do that. Is that better? I want to make sure the width is okay. That's all right. I like the width of that. That's good. That's good. So we could do that. We can just do control B. Now if I merge them together and do this. Hmm. What is it that I want to do? I don't know. How about you? Selection invert. Let's just make this this from there. There we go, control D. And then what we can do is select this. Selection invert, control X. Then go back to here where we're just testing the positioning, control V. There we go, look at that giraffe. Now Bob's your fucking uncle. Now we can move this around and figure out where we would want it. Because I think that works pretty well. Ah! 
What are you doing, Liam? I do like it there, though. I put it there. That fits okay. I think size wise, that's okay. It might be a bit too big. I'm not too sure. One, two, three, four, five. Aria, you returned. How you going? It's been fucking forever. How you going, concrete? Let's go. Yeah, you know, let's I think that's an okay spot. You live. You do fucking live. Had an event for morning so far. Yesterday I did quite a lot of work on trying to make a new overlay. And then today I'm tinkering with it a bit. So I'm upgraded a bit more of it again. And so hopefully it'll be a really clean, nice design. That's the aim at least. But how are you going? Are you living? Are you vibing? I am going to move this all the way up here though. Move this all the way up to the top. This card. This cord border idea. That's the border area. If I'm making it a border, I don't fucking know yet. So let's just do that for now. Let's do overlay screen shine. Page shine. Bird. No, dodge. Why don't you dodge? Pin light. Hard mix. Hard light. Now, you've been hella busy? Fucking hell yeah, you must have been. <laughs> Everything going alright now at least? At the moment I'm trying to figure out where I want a Discord overlay. Uh, so this is just a test sort of uh, cause I am trying to learn like the principle, the F principle of reading and see what's the most natural. So I could go up here, but is that too high and distracting? I don't want to distract people's eyes too much. As an ADHD person, I know how that can feel. It's okay. So maybe it's a bit too close. Got to st finish studying for your finals, but I should be a bit more free. Hell yeah. Good shit. Mm, bonk, bonk, bonk. Um, that looks like that's an okay spot. The size might be off, though. Mm, I could make it larger or could make it shorter. I don't know. But I guess either way. Um. Hmm. Rearrange my room today? Fucking hell yeah. <laughs> Fairy lights? Woo! Do it. Do it. Get the lights. Get the fairy lights. Leia. Copy. Uh, unthingy. Make it visual. This is the... The... Back up, let's move the back up, up, back up, 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 back up, up, move the back up, up, move the motherfucking back up, up, yeah. I don't know where I want it, but this'll do. Ah, there at the very least. And now also me and Clover died of herping. Hell yeah. I knew you were thinking about it at one stage, er ages ago, but. That's cool. How's that turned out? You happy with it? Uh, let me think. Where's the lighting coming from? I need a... We're reverse horizontal. No. 
up there, reverse vertical. Uh, where's the light coming from? There. Yeah, bam. So that should be alright if I did that. Then I need to do this. Not that much will be seen, but at the very least it gives a good indicator of where the light source is, which is important. Uh, I do want a little bit of texture there, so I could do this. I could, I could, I could. Is Clobber okay now? Is Clobber feeling better? It's been a, it's been a long time since Clobber's been alive. My eyes. Um, I don't fucking know. Extra wise, sure. Let's do that. Why the fuck not? Why the fuck not? I don't know. Why not I? Do 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 do. Uh, yeah, let's do let's do that there. Then I go you all the way back and back here. Here nah. Now I'll give it a select. Then I go back here and I go invert the selection, delete, control D's nuts, and then disk rock. I'm gonna call it. Bobber isn't in hospital anymore. Fuck yeah. I'm glad you guys share the brain cell and good old besties. Doing some course at the moment. She's only really has weekends at home. That makes sense. Anxiety's been pretty intense recently. Yeah, no, that makes sense. Well, if there's any way I can help, let me know. But I'm sorry to hear that. But yeah, happy to help, however. I hope they feel better soon. Uh... They're always happy to be here. They're always good here if they ever want to join. Uh, that's about that high, so that needs to be about this high. Is that high enough? No, it's not. Curses. Yeah, it is. is this good enough? The club is always welcome. Everyone knows we all love her. Hell yeah. Yeah, but I know. Obviously, anxiety makes... Anxiety is a good liar. So, it can always make things difficult. So, I defs get that. So, always here to help. Um, the club is always welcome. Hell yeah. Welcome to the club. <laughs> if club are streams, we should say welcome to the club. Disc. Over. Moving this bad boy all the way over here. Moving this bad boy here. How the fuck do I want to move it? Sure, yeah, why not? Do do do. I mean, no, no, no. I mean, no, 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 no. Welcome to the club. Oh, yeah, obviously, club, I wouldn't stream, but yes, welcome to the club. Too much of the tea of the Angs. Hey, hold on, where the fuck is it? Here. Oh, is it too low? Where the fuck? Oh, yeah, it's probably too low because Discord border needs to be above Discord rock, which needs to go there, which then means if I do this, oh, fucking yes, call me a titty and extra bitty. Oh, nuts. Eh. Yeah. Bam. Control D's. Doo -doo. Now, well, we're gonna buy some fairy lights. Catch you later. Hell yeah.
Well, I'm about to go on a break too, and then I'll be back later anyway. I just want to quickly suss whether this works or not. That's, uh, it's a bit too gray. That is not great. <laughs> so funny. If I do that, I mean, that sort of works. It's just as is, and then I can add some other bits later. But technically, if I go, where is it? Border ideas to electric boogaloo. Do, 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 do. Layer. Copy layer. Border ideas. Disk. Do, do, What's fucking invisible here? Uh, delete this one. Delete. Uh, get rid of that. Delete that. Can I move this entire thing now? I can. Fuck yeah. I'm going to resize this and I'm going to go on a thick old break to do some things I need to do. Then I'll hopefully be back uh, in an hour up to two hours. That's my thought. I don't want the rent. Uh, let's get rid of the rent. Uh, I could keep the rent there. Why not? I do want to move this one up. Moving it up. Yep. Do 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 do. Two PM, I guess that makes it time to dip.
Now, if I went back to the other one, let's see how it looks now. Cool. So that's all where our work and stuff has gone at the moment. Um, I think if I go recent donor tech settings, uh, let's remove the, let's remove that. See what that's like. Okay. I think we do need the bold. What do we need to make this a bit better? Move this across a bit, I think. So that way, recent dono can go across a bit more. And I can go settings and increase its width. There, that looks. Okay, I can't tell how compressed it is because of the display, the preview. Hmm, I'm not too sure. Uh, what if I went to here? I'm gonna get rid of that one. So looking at how it's been changed and upgraded, uh, I do want to get the chat border. Ah, oh, no, you don't. Uh, now I have to move everything again. Oh no! Let's just reload it. Reload. Let's have a look. I want to see. Obviously, the wear chain thing's there because it's a test. Move that a bit. Interesting. I'm interested to see. So, the Discord one sort of works there. I think. Chat works okay. Linktree works. It's not doing the scroll at the moment. Which, I mean... It just doesn't. Sometimes it breaks because stream elements is weird. I think the main issue now, aside from the spectralizer, is a few other things I can do after I go on my quick errand run break. Um, is effectively I need to I want to fix up the text, um, and fix up what I want to do with the chain, and then it's pretty much good enough to use this concept for the rest of the overlays. But We'll see what we want to do when I come back. So I'll be back in anywhere between one to two hours. Um, so I, I won't do the BRB thing, I think. Because obviously I don't want to um, have this on for one to two hours on BRB for no reason. So I'm going to go for a break for one to two hours. Um, I'll shut down the stream. But keep an eye on my Discord or my Twitter. And I'll mention when i'm about to go live otherwise thanks for popping by everyone love you all and i'll see you soon yes 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 i will